Hello, welcome to another Dominion 6 mod nation showcase. Today we are taking a look at Middle Age Sargassia Kelp Parasites. So, apparently, this, uh, the weakest uh, kelp things that are called Sargas seeds can be parasites and can mind control other things, such as Elithids. So, they were quite resistant to Relia. Let's check out the magic side. Produce 3 nature gems, 1 astral pearl and 1 earth gem per turn. The troop lineup is mostly the same, but there are some changes. The Sargas seed has 2 fist attacks, amphibian, blunt fierce resistant, poison resistant, need not eat, dark vision 50 and void sanity. They are weak, they are frail, cowardly, but they cost uh, only 4 gold. Laminarid Warriors, they have Coral Spears, all the other plant tags, and they basically have the human stat line with protection 7. Laminarid Guards, they cost slightly more gold, they have Turtle Shell Shields, still no manufactured armor, only natural protection 7. Coralids have evolved. Now they are called high coralids and they have these uh, short torsos with arms and they have coral knives and two stings. They still are aquatic, have poison resistance, blind and poison barbs. Actinids, they did not change from the early age. They are still size 4 creatures, with 22 hit points, 15 strength. Amphibian, Poison Resistant, Blind and Poison Skin have Claw and Animony Poison. Poriferids did not change. Their size 4 creatures with 25 hit points, 16 strength, 2 fist attacks. Amphibian, Poison Resistant, Need Not Eat, Recuperation, Blind Reinvigoration 3 and Land Encumbrance 5. So they tire out on land but not in the water. Sargasid Parasite. That's, that one is new. It's very expensive. Basically this is an Illithid Warrior with a Sargasid attached to it. Amphibian, Blunt Resistant, Magic Being, Dark Vision, Void Sanity, Meteorite Trident, Mind Blast, some actual armor, and when it dies, it also spawns a Sargas seed. The capital only sacred is the same, Viridian Algoid. A size 6 Vine Ogre with high strength and lots of hit points, but not much in terms of protection. All the plant tags, sacred and strangulation and fist attacks. Two attacks per square, since they are size 6. The commanders. Uh, they have uh, changed significantly. First we have the Parasite Assassin. Uh, amphibian, Blunt Resistant, Stealthy, Dark Vision, uh, Assassin 2, Void Sanity with a Dagger and a Mind Blast. Uh, so this is a Star Child with a Sargasid attached. Laminated Commander did not change from the early age. Still just a basic commander with leadership 70. High Coralid commander. Just like the normal Coralids, they have evolved and gained some a semblance of a torso. So they now have arm slots and coral knives. Laminary priest. is a holy one priest, the same as he was in the early age. Uh, now this is new. We have the filterer. Uh, that's a Poriferid Mage. He is a Water 2 Mage with Amphibian, Poison Resistant, Need Not Eat Recuperation, Blind and Land Encumbrance. But when they come on land, uh, they... They do what? Uh, I think they gain an Air Path in, uh, in place of one of the Water Paths. The Brain Corals have evolved as well. They became brain coralids, so they can move now, 
We have two sting attacks, two miscellaneous slots, astral one, death two, 40% astral death random, aquatic, poison resistant, blind poison barbs. Some of the Thaumalgi have disappeared. Now we only have the brown Thaumalgi with earth two, nature one. 50% Earth and Rare Earth Nature Random. Golden Thaumalgi with Fire 2 Astral 1. 50% Fire and Rare Fire Astral Nature Random. And Yellow Green Thaumalgi with Astral 2 Nature 1. 50% Astral and Rare Astral Nature Random. The capital only uh, Sacred Priest, 42 Priest. The Viridian Laminarite is the same as he was before. Nothing really special. And we get another capital only commander that is slow to recruit a Parasite Star Spawn. That's uh, a Ralea Star Spawn with a Sargasit attached to it. Water 1 Astral 3. 2 guaranteed Water Earth Astral Death Randoms and 1 Rare 1. Uh, amphibian, plant resistant, magic being, dark vision, void sanity. So they are quite strong. Let's take a look at the summons. We have some old ones and have some new ones. First, the old ones. In construction 6 you can cast Coral Golem construction for 12 gems. Uh, this Nature 3 Astral 2 spell produces one Coral Golem. This is a big creature with lots of strength and hit points, decent protection, amphibian, uh, some elemental resistances, construct traits, blind and poison barbs. It has a poison claw attack and a ranged uh, Coral Stars attack that does work underwater and uh, releases uh, 6 projectiles per attack but can only attack thrice. In Enchantment 3 you can cast Skeleton Calcification, that's a Death 2 Astral 1 spell for 7 gems. You summon 12 plus Calcified Skeletons. They are just uh, a long dead with high protection. In Alteration 3 you can cast Animate Calcified Mannequin, that's a Nature 2 Astral 1 spell. For 13 gems you summon 12 plus calcified mannequins. Uh, they are just like mannequins uh, with slip pines, high protection due to calcification and all the mannequin traits. So this is a skeleton animated by a Sargas seed. In Contration 4 you can cast Contact Kelp Angel. That's a nature 1 holy 3 spell, for 10 gems you summon 1 kelp angel commander. That's this uh, being with very high skills and stats. It's sacred, amphibian, O1, blunt pierce resistant, invulnerable 20, poison resistant, need not eat, flying blind, and has a great sort of sharpness. So that's, that's a strong one. But it does require Holy 3, so you need to prophesize somebody to cast it. In Alteration 4 you can cast Elder Parasitism. That's an Astral 2 Holy 3 spell, another Prophet spell. For 10 gems you summon 4 plus Elder Parasites. They have Paralyze, Mind Blast. They are basically the same as the Elder Things of Relea. Very sacred, amphibian, poison resist, magic beat, need not eat blind, spirit sight, void sanity, paralyzing explosion on death. And uh, that's it. In Alteration 3 you can cast Pillar Parasitism, that's an Earth 2 Holy 3 spell. For 12 gems you summon 5 plus Pillar Parasites. So they are the living pillars. Uh, overtaken by the Sargas Seeds. They have Basalt Spears that deal magic damage, Bites, Basalt Armor, uh, Sacred, Amphibian, Fire Resistant, Cold Resistant, Castle Defense Bones, Dark Vision, and Void Sanity. They are quite decent. Uh, but you can see that there are three spells that can only be cast by a Prophet. 
due to requiring Holy 3. We have the same hero from the early age, Viridian Saumalgi, who has 5 random magic paths except for blood. That's a multi hero. And we also have the same national item from the early age, the Calcifier, that requires construction 3 and death 2 and provides you with stone skin. The pretenders are the same as before, and we have the national variant of the Lich, the Calcified Lich, who has Water 1, Death 2, Amphibian, Pierce Resistant, Cold Resistant, Poison Resistant, Undead, Inanimate, Nibnatid, and Immortality with a period of 3 months. And that is it. Thank you for watching, next time we are going to take a look at Late Age Sargassia.